Good morning, 95.1 listeners. This is Pastor Lauren with our Thursday Thought. I was thinking the other day about the story of the barnyard geese by the Danish philosopher Søren Kierkegaard and how it applies to life. The story goes, one day in the barnyard, some geese were flying overhead in their majestic V formation, winging their way to sunny weather and better days. So the preacher goose got up on the top rail and extolled them in the glories of goosedom and how they were meant to be free, and how there was a much better life out there, and there was things to see and things to do. And the geese got happy and excited and flapped their wings and claimed in excitement, yes, that's who we are, this is who we're supposed to be. There's things out there to do outside of here. And as the geese in the sky got out of sight, just trailed off out into wherever they were going, the um, barnyard geese looked around their surroundings, but well, we have food here, and we have shelter here, and we know what we're going to get pretty much every day. So they got excited, and they flapped their wings, but they never learned how to fly. And I think sometimes that's very true with all of us. We get caught up into our comfort zone, and I know sometimes I do. That's why it took me so long to break free from my addictions, as I was comfortable there. It wasn't glamorous. It was kind of like a barnyard, but at least I knew what to expect. But we get comfortable, and areas of our life, and we never break out of that comfort zone. And sometimes we think about it and even get excited about it, but we just never move on to new surroundings. Let me say a prayer for us. Lord, help us to get out of our comfort zone and move on to new horizons and so on to something that is much better than where we are right now. And it is so easy for all of us to get caught up in the normalcy of our life, if you will, or our comfort zone and just stay there. And I just pray that for myself, sometimes I need to break free, and so do a lot of other people out there, and you'll help us to do that. Amen. Until we meet up again on the airwaves, blessings to you.